Hey, what's up? It's um Rodrigo. Just um, wanted to share something with you all. Uh, me and Brandon Lacey Campos have been um, working on this piece for a while now. Um, it's regarding the swine flu, so I guess you, for now you can call it a swine flu poem. Um, I've had writer's block for six last past six months, so it's been hard for me to get something. But um, last night I got I got through it, and today I knew it was one of the things I wanted to do. So I'm over here at my mom's place, um, doing laundry, uh, and also uh, writing. And so this is my verse for the swine flu poem. It's rough. It's is good though, and I wanted to share with you all. Um, and hopefully soon, um, we letting this piece go. Should be a lot of fun. So, take a listen. It's been decided. I'm having my tia give this whole country a cleansing. Let her pass the egg over this nation and get rid of the illness we call racism. And if that's not enough, I'm bringing the shaman that took me in that day in Cusco so he can show me the truth with coca leaves. And if that don't work, I'm calling for an insurrection so it does leave. Because this illness has caused famine, brought back manifest destiny. Now we killing Mexicans because we feel like it. Shoot fathers in the back and broadcast it worldwide. Kill Hmong youth and plant the evidence. Shoot up houses and always ask questions later. Question. Do you still want to call me a hater? Walk a block in my frontera and a quarter of a mile in my shoes and you will find it the longest trail of tears and the heaviest shoes filled with lies and broken promises. Perhaps then you might begin to see why we white. And if I could transform my words into a vaccine, I'd make sure to call Obama and over a beer convince him and the FDA to bypass Congress and make this mandatory so we can be infected with the truth. Take a page out of Hans Carlson's a la carte and call this a poemdemic and the virus contagious poesis. Yes, I am diagnosing this nation and tell them we hold the vaccine. Come find us.